I'm Ben. I'm Jacob. And now we're the Five Guys. <laughs> We're the owners of the Frying Dutchman. Basically, I was in Amsterdam with my girlfriend. We were eating great French fries. You know, it was really great there. We wanted to bring it back to the States. Uh, I've known Jacob since high school, and we decided that we wanted to bring it back here. All great ideas require money, so Ben came to me, and we took it from there. The loan money went to the truck you see right here. Um, it also went to make sure that we could hire a great chef. It went to where we could park our truck at night and uh, to get the recipes done. In terms of the business structure, I really had no idea what to do. I knew how to you know, operate a fry truck, but I didn't know how to start a business. I definitely didn't know how to choose a business structure. I love my french fries. And so luckily, we have my friend John, who knows the business very well, yeah. and he helped us pick a structure. These guys don't know what they're doing. That's why they asked me. I'm wearing the suit. What? What? To determine the business structure, uh, John basically helped us look at what would be the easiest for us to do and what would be the best for us financially in terms of taxes. We settled on an S-Corp because when we look at taxes in terms of paying for the individual versus the company, it's the cheapest alternative. An S-Corp is specifically good for the Frying Dutchman because they need full liability protection for food services. The only real difference between an S-Corp and a C-Corp is that you're not getting double tax for it. We pay through the personal tax and we don't have a corporate tax. Oh yeah, maybe that's Tax once, I could deal with that. Tax twice, what's up for me? Since we have an S corporation, it means every week we have to have shareholders meetings where we take notes, talk about what we've done that week and how we want to grow and expand the business. And I tend to eat a lot of french fries. It does. S corp helps us expand our business. Look, we have employees. At the end of each week, we take the money we've made minus the expenses, we put it in the bank account, and then we pay off our investor and also pay sales tax. Being an S-Corporation really allows us to save money and plan for future growth, which will allow us to expand to other cities around the country. Run tries for everyone. If I were to give advice to a young entrepreneur trying to figure out which business structure to use, I would say go to a friend, a lawyer, your dad, your mom, and basically ask what works best for your company. Just like finding the right dipping sauce, you have to find the right business structure for you.